We're in Columbus, Ohio, where there are over 100,000 fans getting ready to see the start of this game. And we've got overcast weather for today's matchup between the Ohio State Buckeyes and the Michigan Wolverines. EA Sports welcomes you to another game of NCAA football. Hi, everybody. I'm Brad Nessler here with my co-hosts, Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit. Let's send it down to the field now for the Coca-Cola Coin Toss. Ohio Number 23, State get set to kick this one away. To return. Decent kick. Number 17 takes it at the four. And down we go at the 26. And now we get to see this offense for the first time as they head out onto the field. So, Kirk, we talked before the broadcast about this running back who just came on the field, and I think he should have a spectacular game. Well, there's no doubt he's the key to their offense, Brad. It's going to be interesting to see how he holds up against this tough front seven. We'll have to keep an eye on him as this game plays out. It's second down and four to go. Ball on their own 32. Drops back to pass. Let's it fly. This one will fall incomplete. Number 15 was the intended target, so that'll make it third down. It's third and four. Ball on the 32-yard line. Michigan goes with the ace set here. Back to pass. Looks. He delivers. Now who's the penalty going to be called on here? That was a good call. The defender was all over. First down. Sometimes holding up a defender is better than letting him go for a big game. First or even worse, a ball touchdown. The they line up at the 47. First down. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. They'll bring him down at the 50-yard line. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. They line up at the 50. Second down. And they have three bunts. They hand it off again. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. They didn't let him get anything going on that play. No, they didn't. Heck, they didn't even let him get back to the line of scrimmage. We've got third and ten. Ball on the 47. Michigan lines up in a double tight set. He drops back. Throws it out there. And that one's incomplete. Number 89 was the intended receiver on the play. And that'll make it fourth down. It's fourth down. The Wolverines line up the punch. Number 41 is the putter. Seven. Number 41 punts it, and he really got a leg into this one. And now we get to see this offense for the first time as they head out onto the field. This is what college football is all about. Oh, with the option. They come out with four wide out. They'll run the option. And he's tackled at the 20-yard line. No gain. That'll bring up second down. The key here is making sure the offensive line gives the quarterback plenty of time to find the open receiver. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 20. Number 25 is a deep back as they line up in the eye. Play action, throws it. And it's knocked down. Number seven was the intended receiver on that pass. That'll make it third down. I'd come out throwing here. You know you got a ways to go for the first, so I'd just approach it like any other player. Ball on the 20 yard line.
The Wolverines line up with six defensive what? backs. Drop back to pass. He's looking. He's under pressure. And he's level at the 10. Man, did you ever get hit that hard, Kirk? You bet. I just cringe when I see hits like that on the quarterback. It's a lot safer up here in the booth, that's for sure. So it's fourth down. Ohio State lining up the punt. Number 15 to punt. He gets it off. And they make the fair catch at the 49. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. First and ten. Ball on the 50. Ball on the 50 yard line. Number 20 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Back to pass. Surveys the field. And he's hit as he throws. Not a pretty pass right there. No, it wasn't, Kirk. That was not a good pass at all. But hey, in his defense, he had to get it off to avoid the sack. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 50. Number 20 lines up as a single back. On the ground with a tailback. Tackle made at the 47. Number 20 gains around three yards on the run. They line up at the 47. Third down. The Buckeyes bring in the nickel package. Play action across the middle, and it's caught. And a nice pass to the tight end. Yeah, this is what I like. Move the ball down the field. Use that nice and steady intermediate passing game. First We've got ten. a first and ten. Ball on the 33-yard line. You'll get it again. He's taken down at the 31-yard line. Gain of two. Gain of two on the play. I love a good draw play. You got the Second defense thinking nine. pass, ball then you run the ball for a nice game. Line. Number seven with three wide receivers. <laughs> on the ground, right side. And he's tackled at the 26-yard line. Number 20 gains about five yards on the run. That'll bring up third down. Third this defense faces another All third down. On the 26-yard line. Number 20 lines up as a single back. He gets another carry. Drop back a yard. One yard loss on the play. It looks like they're going to try for the long field goal. This one is from about 44 yards away. This will make it a field goal game. He gets it up, and he got it, and he's got to be happy about that kick. Oh, no question. This kid is just a solid kicker. Number Looks like they're ready, ready for the return. kick. He kicks it. Number 11 fields it at the one. Can't wrap him up. They'll bring him down at the 22-yard line. Not a whole lot of success the last time out. At all, this offense has to do a better job of staying on the field and giving their defense a chance to catch their breath. First, First and ten. Ball on the 22-yard line. The Buckeyes come out in the ace formation. They hand it off. And down he goes at the 23-yard line. Nothing doing on the halfback draw. You got to keep the defense honest by throwing in a good play-action pass every now and then. Ball on the 23-yard line. Single set backfield. There's a play fake. Under pressure. He's tackled at the 40. Nice gain on the play. The ball was thrown. Perfect. 
perfectly. Good precision there. First, First down, down, 10 to go. Ball on the 40-yard line. Yard line. Number 25, the lone back. Little handoff. Couldn't get anything out of that. That'll bring up second down. A well-tuned option will give defenses a fit. Second and 10. Ball on the 40-yard line. The Buckeyes come out showing three wide. He drops back. Looks, he passes it. Intercepted off the tip. Make the move. Oh, he got tattooed on that one. It's the safety who's in the right place at the right time. The quarterback has to know where the safety is when he makes this kind of throw. Right here, he just tried to force something that wasn't there. I call this one the Scooter Special. Try it right now. Ball on the 36-yard line. One man backfield. There's a play fake. Flips it. It's complete. How about that play? That's a good pickup there. He just dropped back and delivered a nice throw. Second and four coming up here. Ball on the 30-yard line. Ball on the 30-yard line. Single set back for you. He drops back. Looking. He's looking for his man. And it's caught. He goes the footsteps and makes the catch. A nice completion to the tight end. A good play here, and the thing that I notice is that he provides a nice big target out there for the quarterback. I like running here in this situation. It's First a safer ball. play. Ball on the 10 yard line. For the first time today, we'll get to see how this defense responds when they're backed up into the red zone. Touchdown, Touchdown. Michigan! And how about that run, guys? Well, I think he's a fine running back. Somebody, you got to design an entire defensive scheme to stop. Just look at that last touchdown run. He knows where the end zone is, and he gets there. The kick is up. He splits the uprights with the extra point. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary. Michigan Number 41, ready to kick. Off. Number 11, back to return. He kicks it. Number 11, fields it at the two. Flag down. He jukes. Broke away from one. Flag down, and I'm not sure when it was thrown. Let's find out. Clipping on the receiving team. So they'll move back after that costly penalty, and they'll have to try to get that yardage back here. Everyone should know this one. Now go make it happen. First and 10. Ball on the 17-yard line. Ohio State lines up with three receivers. Draw play. Tackle at the 18-yard line. Number 25 gains about a yard on the play. That'll bring up second down. We've got second and nine here. Ball on the 18-yard line. Number 25 is the single setback. Drops back to pass. Looks. He wants it all going long. And he's got it. At the 40. At the 30. Down the sideline. The 10. He's going to take it to the barn. Touchdown. The wide receiver flew down the field on that touchdown connection. Well, he has the speed to stretch the defense, and his hands are getting better every single game. Here's the extra point to get within a field goal. It's up. He makes the PAT. And here's the Pontiac drive summary. Number 23 looks ready to kick this one off. Kicks it away. Missed tackle. Well, the offense heading back out onto the field after that kick. 
hoping to turn this drive into another touchdown. First it's first and ten. And ten. Single set back to you. He drops back. He looks. Throws this one out to the right. And it falls incomplete. He overthrew his tight end. I know the tight end has a little more height than the wideouts, but give me a break. Second it's second and ten. Ball on the 22-yard line. Michigan comes out with an eye formation. Let's go! Drops back to pass. He's looking. He unloads it. Catches it. At the 40. At the 30. To the 20. To the 10. Wait a second. They put the points on the board, but they might have to take them down. On the defense. They hooked up for the big play. The coaches do a good job of getting this receiver the ball. They design plays specifically for him, like the one we just saw. And the end results are huge chunks of yardage and touchdowns. Here's the try for the extra point. It's up. And he tacks on the extra point. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Michigan. Number 41 looks ready to kick this one off. Number 11, back deep to return. And this one's away. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The offense ready for the first play of this drive. They moved the ball extremely well on their last possession on their way to the end zone. An experienced coach would want to run this play. On that chin strap and go out there and hit somebody. First, first and 10. Ball on the 20-yard line. Number 25 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Let's go! Right. He drops back. Throws to the middle. This one is batted away. That's just good defense right there, Coach. It was, Kirk, but you know what? It's all reaction. Anytime you're out there on defense and the pass is within arm's length away, you ten. knock it down. Ball on Second the down, 10 yards line. to go. Ball on their own 20. Ohio State lines up in a shotgun set. Under heavy pressure. He sheds it. You got to execute in this long yarded situation. Just take the snap and wing it in there. Michigan lines up with five defensive backs. Back to pass. He looks. Throws it deep downfield. Complete. Lost the ball. Fumble. Number seven. Scoops it up. Looks like they got a lucky break there, guys. What was the receiver doing on that play? Well, he sure wasn't holding onto the football very well, that's for sure. It's first and ten. Ball on the 42. 42 yard line. Two tight end set. They'll give it off here. And he stopped behind the line. That was a fantastic play by this defense. Lee, you're right. Poor halfback. He had nowhere to go. This play should work out very nicely. Second and 11. Ball on the 43-yard line. Ohio State comes out with two tight ends. Again with the run. Brought down at the 37-yard line. Number 25 gains around six yards on the run. That'll make it third down. Third and five coming up. Ball on the 37-yard line. Number 10 lines up in the shotgun. Drops back to pass. Throws this one out to the right. It's complete. Great concentration. Nice job by the quarterback to hit the tight end for a decent game. Hey, this guy's not going to burn too many guys deep, but he's definitely a good possession guy who you can rely on. First, First and ten. ten. Ball on the 23-yard line. Ohio State goes with the ace set here. What? Nice play fake. Throws down the middle. Got it to the senior. They'll bring him down at the one-yard line. The wideout made a good-looking grab there. You're right, and the quarterback threw it as soon as he saw he had that extra step. First down and goal to go.
For the first time today, we'll get to see how this defense responds when they're backed up into the red zone. Nothing complicated about that one, Coach. The halfback took it in for six. You're right. It doesn't have to be quantum physics to get in the end zone. Just good execution. Here's the extra point to get within a field goal. The kick is up. He makes the PAT. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary. Ohio State is ready to kick it away. Number 17, back deep to return. He kicks off. They throw a flag. Makes a move. There's a flag down, and it looks like this one's coming back. Clipping on the receiving team. That one will put the offense in a hole, and they'll First try down. to get some of that back on this upcoming play. Tell your quarterback to stand in there and make a play. First, First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 13-yard line. Number 20, the lone back. Back to pass. Looks. Let's it fly. It falls incomplete. Number 16 was the intended target. That'll make it second down. The key here is making sure the offensive line gives the quarterback plenty of time to Second find the 10. open receiver. Ball on the 13-yard line. The Wolverines come out in the ace formation. Ready! Drop back to pass. He looks. He's looking down the middle. They knock it down. Incomplete. Nice job getting a hand on that one. Yeah, really good heads-up play there to get a hand on the football by the defense. We've got third and ten. The Wolverines come out in the ace formation. He drops back. He wants it all. Batted away. That's a fantastic defensive effort. Yeah, the deflection prevented them from getting any yards. And now, it's fourth down. Fourth, and fourth down. They line up to punt this one away. Number 41 is waiting for the snap. Number 41 punts it, and this is a wonderful kick. Number seven fields it to 37, and he's taken down at the 45. Thanks to some nice passing on the last drive, the offense was able to take it down the field for six. And great play calling to help make that an easy drive. The question is, can they do it again? Ohio State sets up in the eye, drops back to pass. Looking, he passes it. And they bring him down at the 26. What a play. What a play is right. Here they throw the ball to the tight end, and the big guy shows that he's valuable not only as a blocker, but as a receiver as well. Nice catch. It's first and 10. Ball on the 26. And that'll be the end of the first quarter with our score. Michigan, 17. Ohio State, 14. Ohio State, 14. This is where you just go with what you know the best. They line up in an eye. They're going to pitch it. He's tackled at the 25. Not much there. Maybe a yard. That'll make it second down. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 25. High formation here. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. He throws. He catches another one. Fellas, he's really out to an outstanding start in this football game. Hey, if he continues at this pace, he may throw for 500 yards. I'll tell you what, this guy is so much fun to watch when he gets into a rhythm like this.
Number 25 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. And they'll run him again. He's taken down at the 10. How about that conversion on third down? Good push here by the guys up front, and they are really starting to work hard in the trenches. Let me tell you something. The biggest compliment you can give a coach is that his team is playing hard. And you're right. These guys are playing real hard right now. Back to pass. He's looking. He throws it. And it's caught. Way to look at it. The pass good for maybe seven yards. The defense might be looking for a run. So I'd put the ball in the air and try to get six. Number 25 lines up as a single back. Touchdown, Ohio State. The halfback ran it in for the touchdown. I'd give this guy the ball every time there's a short yarded situation. He's money. You mean he's an ATM, automatic touchdown machine. Where do you come up with these? They just come to me, my friend. The kick is up. And he adds the extra point. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Number 23 looks ready to kick this one off. Number 17, back to return. He hits a booming kick. at the 14. Well, the offense couldn't get anything going on their last drive. Let's see if they can do a little bit better here. First down, 10 to go. Ball on their own 14. The Wolverines go with the I formation. Which is right. They'll get him for a loss. No place to go that time, and the offense loses a yard or two. Nice job of plugging up all the gaps and the possible cutback lanes by the defense. Second down and 12. Michigan comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Back to pass. Looking, lets it go. Complete, and he's tackled right away. They pick up solid yardage there. Yeah, nice little pitch and catch there. The wideout was able to find a little open space in the defense, and the quarterback was able to get him the ball for a good pickup. The Wolverines line up in an I formation. And he's taken down at the 33. A five-yard pickup for the tailback. This pitch play is a good call here. I'd get my guys psyched up to block out there. Ball on the 33-yard line. Number 20, alone in the backfield. Again, he'll get the call. Tackle at the 38, five yards. That'll make it third down. I'm full of good plays. Try this one. It's third down and short. Ball on their own 38. Michigan lines up in a double tight set. And he's tackled the 39 yard line. Now yeah, they stuck with the run and it pays off for it. You know what, Brad? So important on third down to rely on the offensive line to get a good push. And that's what they did there to pick up the first down. We've got a first and 10. Again with a carry. Brought down at the 41 yard line. Gain of two. Gain of two on the play. Hey, Kirk. It looks like this kid just spent the night out on the town. Well, he took a big hit there, Coach. I don't think he's got his equilibrium back yet. They line up in an eye. Back to pass. Let's it go. Brings it in with one hand. That one worked pretty well. It's a good job here by the wide receiver to get open. He created good separation from the defense. It's first and ten. This is the eighth play of this drive.
Number 20 lines up as a single back. They'll throw on first down. Looking. He's looking down the middle. The defender had it and then dropped it. The quarterback is going to think twice about throwing the football his way again. Well, safety couldn't hang on to the ball this time. But you can bet if he gets a chance again, this ball will be picked ball off. It's second yard. and ten. Number 20, the lone back. Back to pass. He looks. He lets it go. It's complete. Tackle at the 41-yard line. Number 20 picks him up about three yards with a catch. They'll line it up again on third down. On the 41-yard line. Ohio State brings in their nickel package. Drops back to pass. He's under pressure. And he hits him hard at the 47 yard. Michigan takes a timeout, and they've got two remaining. Number 41 is the putter. Seven. Punts the ball away. And they'll down it at the eight-yard line. You know what drives me crazy? What's that, Kurt? When players don't look for the ball on special teams, too often the gunners don't locate the ball and let it go into the end zone. But this guy did a great job of getting downfield and downing the ball, giving his defense good field position. The Buckeyes line up with two tight ends. There's a play fake. Now he's scrambling. He throws it. Almost picked off. Way to keep your head on a swivel, kid. That was a nice job of locating the football and knocking it down to prevent the completion. Sure was, coach. He put himself in great position to make a play. Second down and 10 to go. Single set backfield. Little handoff. Number 25 gets three yards on the play. Three yard gain on the play. I like this one. Go see what you can do with it. Third it's third and seven. And seven. Ball on the 11 yard line. Number 10 comes to the line with three wide. He drops back. He's looking. He throws right. It's complete. Good open field tackle. Oh, man, he doesn't get the first. Great play by the defense. Incredible. They saw that coming a mile away. I think you've got to give your quarterback a little bit more time, especially on third down. Fourth, and Fourth down. The punter comes on the field, getting ready to send one off. Number 15, back to return it. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. Number 15, fields it to the 42, tries to juke. Inside the 30, to the 20, to the 10. And they're going to bring this one all the way back. Touchdown! Oh, that's going to get the old heart pumping. I'll tell you what, the special teams coach has to be very proud there. That play was designed perfectly and even executed better. Trying to go up by three, they'll kick the extra point. The kick is up. He makes the PAT. Okay. So we take a moment good. to check out the Pontiac drive summary. Michigan, Michigan is, is ready to kick it ball. away. Number, number 11, 11 and number 7 set to return. He sends it downfield. Number 87 fields it at the 22. And down he goes at the 35. The defense really shut these guys down the last time they had the ball. The offense looked a bit out of sync on that last possession, Coach. And it was the defense that threw them out of sync, Kirk. Those guys are fired up. Let's see if they can hold them again. Michigan brings in the nickel here. Looks. He passes it. He ignores the footsteps and makes the catch. Nice little pitch and catch with a wideout. The quarterback and receiver spend a lot of time together. The coaches say they stay after practice, just working on their timing, and right there it paid off. First, First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 47-yard line. Number 10 lines up in the shotgun. Looking. 
He's looking deep down the left side. And it's caught to the 10. He's all the way. Touchdown. The defense just can't keep up with it. He has lightning speed. He's just so quick and elusive after he catches the football. They'll try to tack on the extra point. He gets it up, and he adds the extra point. And here's the Pontiac drive summary. Number 23 looks ready to kick this one off. Number 17. He sends it downfield. Number 17 takes it at the 14. Fumble. He picks it up. And they finally tackle him at the 23-yard line. And that is a big, big turnover. It looks like to me that someone got the helmet on that ball. The defense calls a timeout, and they'll have one timeout left. They line up at the 23. First down. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Back to pass. He looks, throws it to the outside, and it's knocked down. Coach, you made a nice defensive play there. He sure did. He just stuck his hand out and hit the football. So it's second and ten. on the 23-yard line. Number 25 lines up as a single back. Draw play. He's tackled at the 23. Makes zero yards on that play. So that'll make it third down. It's third down and 10. Ball on the 23-yard line. Single set backfield. He drops back. He's looking. Going for it all to the end zone. Tipped away. Nice play by the defense to bring up fourth down. Yeah, instead of going for the interception, they did the safe thing, and that was just to tip it away. Fourth down. This will be about a 40-yard field goal attempt. Number 23, into a tempo. It's up. And it is good. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Number 23 gets set to kick this one away. Number 17, back deep to return. And he got all of this one. Great kick. Tackle made at the 23-yard line. So the offense comes out after their last drive, has the ball end up in the defense's hands by way of a fumble. Everyone should know this one. Now go make it happen. First, First ten. down, 10 to go. Ball on the 23-yard line. And they have three bunched. And they use motion. Back to pass. Looks. He throws it. Complete. And down he goes. That's the 38. And Herbie, that was a good-looking throw. Yeah, and what impresses me is the composure of this young quarterback. He made a great read, saw the open receiver, and delivered an almost perfect strike. Good-looking play. Number 20, alone in the backfield. They go with a run. And out of the It's good up, and it's the lineman that's got it. Talk about a close call. The running back put the ball on the ground, but the offense keeps possession. Yo, Kirk, 
Is it somebody's birthday on defense? I don't know. Where are you going with this one, Coach? Well, it's got to be somebody's birthday. Because this running back is handing out presents out there. Either that, or he's doing his best to get benched. Now I got you, Coach. Fumble. Birthday present. I got you. On the ground with the tailback. And they get him in the backfield for a loss. Boy, he is one big guy down there on that defensive line. Oh, man, the big fella's a hoss. I saw him last night at the hotel, and he had three bags of food going up to his room. Yo, it looks like he's got a big old bag hanging over his belt right now. He drops back. He's looking. Throws it. Catches it. And they finally push him out at the 39-yard line. Great play to keep his feet in and get the first down. It takes tremendous concentration and field awareness to make a play like that. And the quarterback put him in a place where only his receiver could catch it. Nice throw. Fires deep down the left side. Got him again. And guys, he's already over 200 yards passing in the first half. Well, he's off to a great start. It'll be interesting to see if he can maintain this level of play for the rest of the game. Drop back to pass. Going to the end zone. Wow. Not a smart pass. He thought he could squeeze it in there. Yes. Now the next time he does that, he better be ready to make a tackle. They'll pick him off if he's not careful. They line up in an eye. They go with a toss. And they'll bring him down behind the line. A loss on that one as he couldn't get past those big linemen. Well, you got that right. They sacrificed their bodies in there and stuffed it. He drops back. Looking. Let's it fly. Catches it. Great concentration. They'll get six yards. Gain of six on the play. Fourth down. They'll line this up and it'll be about a 21-yarder. It's up. And he hooked it left. Well, fellas, he can't come through with three points. Like corners who get beat on deep routes and quarterbacks, kickers also have to have a short defense. This guy will be ready to go on his next kick. Michigan will use their final timeout. First, First down, 10 yards to go. On the 20 yard line. Number 10 with three wide receivers. What? On the ground with a tailback. He's taken down at the 25. The halfback picks up maybe five yards on the draw play. Second and five coming up here. Ball on their own 25. Ohio State sets up in the eye. They hand it off again. They'll bring him down at the 30. Four, maybe five yards on the run. I call a play like this to make sure that there's no chance that this kid's going to run out of bounds and stop the clock. The Buckeyes go with the eye formation. They hand it off. At the 45 yard line. A first down. First down, and now they have an opportunity to run some more time off the clock. It's first and ten. Number ten lines up in the shotgun. They'll throw on first down. Looking. Once it all. Going deep. Swatted away. And that was a good defensive play. Yeah, guys, this is because he's in great position to make the play. It's second and ten. Ball on their own 35. I guess he'll throw this one as far as he can and hope for a miracle. Michigan makes an adjustment on defense, drops back to pass. This one is batted away. Well, we've got a barn burner here, and at the end of the first half, our score, Ohio State 31, the Michigan Wolverines 24. Michigan. And we're just about set to get things underway here in the second half. He kicks it off. Number seven fields it at the three. He's tackled at the 31. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out of the field for their next possession. Brian's coach would want to run this play. Ball on the 31 yard line. They line up in a double tight set. Let's it fly. And he pulls it down. Now with a juke. And he's brought down at 
the 37 yard line. And that's the way you're supposed to play pitch and kick. Absolutely. You know, this wide receiver is a difference maker. He's one of those players that has a chance to go the distance every time you get him the ball. Now it's first and 10 after the big pass play. Number 25, the lone back. the ground up the middle and he's taken down at the 37 picked up a yard of anything on that run from the 37 yard line it's second down number 25 alone in the backfield gets past the tackle tackle for a loss loss of three it's a big down right here. You gotta throw in this situation. Third and 12 coming up on this one. Ball on the 40 yard line. Michigan lines up in a dime defense here. Drop back to pass. Looks, he's under some heat. Throws to the middle. And they couldn't hook up on that one. Number eight, the intended receiver on the play. Fourth and 12. And this will be a very Ball long field goal attempt. Number 23 could make it a two-score game. It's up. Well, that's a tough break for these guys who are looking to put three points up on the board. One of my favorite plays in the playbook. First and 10. Ball on the 47-yard line. One man backfield. Ready. Red 18. Red 18. Huh? They'll throw on first down. Uh, throws it. Interception off the deflection. To the 20. To the 10. Touchdown. Bucks. And just like that, they make it a two possession game. They really took the pressure off themselves there. That was a great return for a touchdown, and it gives them some breathing room on defense. Yeah, this offense has a lot of work to do now. They're really going to have to fight to get back in this ball game. They'll line it up for the extra point. Kick is up, and he converts the extra point. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary. State is lining up to kick this one off. He kicks it off. Number 17 takes it from the six. And down he goes at the 30 yard line. I know the first thing I wanted to do after throwing the pick was to come out that next drive and throw. Let the defense know that I wasn't intimidated. And how many times did you go right back in there and throw another pick? First and ten. As you know, a quarterback Ball needs a short memory. So I really don't remember, Scooter. You know better than that. <laughs> Handoff. He's tackled at the 34. Four yards game. That'll make it second down. Second and six coming up here. Ball on their own 34. Again with a carry. They bring him down in the backfield. A great defensive effort there. And let me tell you, the key to that play was right there in the defensive line. They tied this offensive line up Third and allowed seven. their linebackers to come up and make a big play. Lee, I agree with you. We always talk about the linebackers and safeties, but credit the big guys up front for that play. Number seven comes to the line with three wide. Drop back to pass. Looks. He unloads it. And it's caught. Way to look it in. Oh, boy. That is a nice play on third down. The quarterback found his receiver, and they connected on a big play. Big? That's an understatement, Kurt. 
This completion keeps the kick team off the field and gives them a new set of downs. Number 20 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. They'll work the right side. The defensive end was the victor on that play as he bolted in to tackle him for a loss. And he's able to do that because the interior linemen held their ground, leaving the runner with no option. From their own 46-yard line. Second down. The Wolverines come out in the ace formation. He drops back across the middle, and it's incomplete. Number 89 was the intended receiver on that pass. That'll bring up third down. Third and about 13 yards. Ball on their own 46. Number 20 is the single setback. Back to pass. Looks. He delivers. Caught. And he's finally knocked out of bounds at the 29-yard line. That was a beautiful pass play. And you can see why they like running this play. They have the potential to break one every single time they run it. Michigan goes with the ace set here. He drops back. Looks over the middle. This one is incomplete. Number 86 was the intended receiver on that pass. That'll bring up second down. Second and 10. And this is the eighth play of the drive. There's a play fake. And he's level at the 38-yard line. It's the ninth play of the drive. The linebacker shift over a little. He drops back. He's in trouble. Slips it short. Catches it. And he's hit immediately. Doesn't get enough for the first down. Yeah, nice job of making a few yards, but they got to be disappointed they didn't make the first down. They're going to try a long field goal here. This one is from 48 yards away. Number 38 in to attempt the field goal. It's up. Well, they tried for three, but they came up empty-handed. This is one of my favorite plays in the playbook. First and ten. Ball on the 38-yard line. The Buckeyes line up in an I formation. Let's go! Ryan! 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 Back to pass. He throws it. It's complete. He's hit and taken down. A nice completion to the tight end. A good play here. And the thing that I notice is that he provides a nice big target out there for the quarterback. Second and two. Ball on the 46. The Buckeyes line up with three wide. Draw play. He hit and got away. So he picked up a few on that one. Yeah, he did a nice job of using his blockers on that run. Really nice read. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 48. Number 25, the lone back. He gets another carry. Hold on, we got a penalty on the play. Let's check it out. He looked like he had a handful of jersey on that one. You know, you can get away with a little holding, but hey, you can't do that. First so the penalty long. puts him back Ball for a first a and long. Yard line. Ohio State comes out with an eye formation. They keep it on the ground with the tailback. They'll bring him down at the 48. Six yards there on the counter. This play should work out very nicely. Second down, 13 yards to go. Ball on the 48. Number 25 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Gets the ball. Another fake. Oh, he got nailed on that one. Well, he didn't get much out of that scramble. Yo, this kid needs to learn when to scramble. He's going to end up in the hospital if he keeps getting hit like that. It's third and 13. Ball on the 49. The Buckeyes line up with four wideouts. He drops back. Looking. Long ball, right side. 
And it's caught. He goes down at the nine-yard line. Great pass play. This guy comes up with a great catch here. He's got good hands. And when he's on, there's no one in America that can catch him. Their last trip down here was a success. Let's see if this one will result in another touchdown. A little handoff. Gets that one. Touchdown, Ohio State. This kid has been a very integral part of this team's success today, fellas. Absolutely. He's run the ball extremely well between the tackles. That's his third touchdown of the day. A successful offense needs a successful running attack. And that's exactly what this kid brings to the table. It's up. And he tacks on the extra point. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Looks like they're ready for the kick. Number 17, back to return. And it's off. Number 15, fields it at the 7. Brought down at the 25-yard line. Their kicker missed the field goal attempt the last time this offense had it. Anytime you have a shot at putting points on the board and you don't get it, you get a little frustrated. This offense is very capable of scoring at any time. Number 20, lines up in the deep back. Eye formation. There's the play fake. They bring him down. They can't block the defensive end, and he'll get credit for the second. That's excellent athleticism by aware this young what man. The he just beat the man in you. front of him, plain and simple. From their own 24-yard line. Second down. Michigan comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Drops back to pass. He looks. He unloads it. Knocked down, incomplete. Number 15 was the intended receiver on the play. So that'll make it third down. Third and 11, ball on 24. Number 20, the lone back. He drops back. Looking. Deep pass down the right side. Number two, picks it off. Brought down at the 47-yard line. What an interception by the cornerback. I love it. A defensive back with soft hands. This kid can play. Snap on that chin strap and go out there and hit somebody. The Michigan will take a timeout. Time and that was their first timeout. First down, 10 yards to go. On the 47 yard line. The Buckeyes line up with three wide. They'll give it off here. He's tackled at the 46 yard line. They get a good seven yards on that one. That'll make it second down. Second and three coming up. Ball on the 46. On the 46 yard line. Number 25 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. They'll keep it on the ground again. Well, the defense really put the clamps down on that run. Boy, Brad, great effort up front by that defense. Third and four. Ball in the 47. There's the play fake. Surveys the field. Looking long to the right. Oh, he had a shot at the pick. Nice play by the defense to bring up fourth down. The defender made a solid effort to get to the ball there. Nice stop. Fourth down. Ohio State ready to put this one away. Number 15 is deep to receive, and something tells me he's looking for a second return. He gets it away. He hauls it in at the 14. Great job by the defense last time forcing the pick. I wouldn't be surprised to see a few runs here by the offense to start things off. They line up at the 13. First down. Michigan comes to the line with three wide. Back to pass. 
slips it short, catches it. They'll knock him down for a loss. A one yard loss. Give it to the halfback on this sneaky draw play. Ohio State brings in their nickel package. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. He might not be able to get the pass off. And this one's broken up. Number 89 was the intended receiver on the play. That'll bring up third down. Third down and 12. Ball on the 12-yard line. Michigan comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. The cavalry's coming. Let's it fly. And it's caught. A lot of shoving while the pass was in the air. Let's get the call. Pass on appearance on the defense. The penalty is declined. Let's see how well you can run this play. First, First and ten. ten. Ball on the 23. 23-yard line. Number 20, the lone back. Not Drops back to pass. He's looking. He throws it. Incomplete pass. Number 83 was the intended receiver on the play. So that'll make it second down. Second and 10. Ball on the 23-yard line. Setting up the play action. Over the middle. And he's got him again. Oh, man, they had him good there. The defense was looking run, and they threw it for a big game. The running back really sold the run well that time. That allowed for the quarterback to get the ball downfield for a decent game. First and 10. Ball on the 39. The Buckeyes line up with six defensive backs. They'll throw on first down. Surveys the field. He sails it long. Taken down at the 25. 300 yards passing on a day for this quarterback, Kirk. He's been successful picking at this defense all day long. Yeah, Coach, he's really tearing up this secondary. First and 10. Ball on the 25-yard line. Number 20, alone in the backfield. Setting up the play action. Under pressure. He's wrapped up for the sack from the 29-yard line. It's second down. Second and 14. Pat. He's looking. He throws. He gets another, and this is a big one. And that reception put him over 100 yards on the day. Well, this guy is such a big part of this offense. If he doesn't get his numbers, they usually don't have much success moving the football. And that's why he's so valuable to this football team, Kirk. He's a big-time college football player. They're crowding the line. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. Throws it. And it's knocked down. Boy, that was a good defensive effort there. The ball was there, but the defender beat the receiver to it. Nice play. That brings up second and goal. One yard to the goal line. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. The linebackers shift over a little. Back to pass. Throw short. He's in for the score, and they're back in it. That was a sharp pass that found the wide receiver for a score. This kid is going to do some damage. His pocket presence is exceptional, and he's got a good arm. What I'm impressed with is the guy's decision maker. It's up. He makes the PAT. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary. Michigan they line up to kick up this one away. Ball. Number 11, back to return. Kicks it off. There's a flag down. Tries to juke. Flag on the play. Let's see what it is. So they'll move back after that costly penalty, and they'll have to try to get that yardage back here. I'd sell the pass here, and then I'd hand it off to my halfback. First and ten. Ball on the 14-yard line. One man backfield. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. Surveys the field. Looking long to the right. 
complete, and they bring him down at the 43-yard line. Lee, this offense is having some fun out there. You betcha. This quarterback just exceeded 400 yards passing for the game, and I'm going to tell you why he's having all that success. The reason? The play of those receivers. They are running good routes to get wide open, and when the ball is thrown their way, they catch it. Simple. And he tackles him hard at the 48-yard line. This defensive end caused all kinds of problems on that play. You have to keep an eye on this guy, especially during passing situations, because he does a great job of getting to the quarterback, as we saw right there. Second down, and they got 15 for the first down. They come out with three wide receivers. He drops back. He's looking. Throws this one out to the right. He gets hit out of bounds at the 25-yard line. Impressive catch there to stay in bounds and pick up the first down. That's great field awareness because those are not easy catches to make. No, they're not. You have to locate the sideline, locate the ball, then make the catch. And when you have defenders running after you from all angles, it makes it all the more difficult. There's a play fake. He's under some heat. Tipped away. You got to be careful throwing into coverage like that. Well, Coach, I don't think it was a poor decision. It was just a great reaction by the man in coverage. They'll line up at the 25. It's second down. The Buckeyes come out in a shotgun. Throws it. Caught. He ignores the footsteps and makes the catch. The defense looked a little lost on that one, Kurt. And they did, Brad. Nice recognition here by the quarterback to see that confusion and then take advantage of it. And since we're in the red zone, let's have a look at the numbers. Brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters the most. Their last trip down here was a success. Let's see if this one will result in another touchdown. Go into the end zone. And this one falls incomplete. Number 11 was the intended target on the play. That'll bring up second down. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 13-yard line. The Buckeyes line up with two tight ends. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Number 25 picks up two yards with a carry. So that'll make it third down. Third, Third down, eight, eight yards to go. Yard and this is the eighth play of the drive. Number 25 lines up in the deep back, eye formation. Draw play. And he's tackled at the six. So they get five yards there on the halfback draw. This should be an easy field goal. This one from about 23 yards out. Number 23 into a field goal. The kick is up, and they tack on three points. And here's the Pontiac drive somewhere. Number 23 is lined up to kick this one off. Kicks it off. Number 15 takes it to 12. Two moves. He's taken down at the 31. Guys, their last possession, they really had good success passing the ball. Hey, if they ask me, I'd air it out some more. Lee, I agree. Make them show you that they can stop it before you change things up. Michigan comes to the line with three wide. He drops back. Looking. He lets it go. Catches it at the 40. At the 30. And they bring him down at the 20-yard line. Well, these guys aren't going belly up yet. That's a big throw and catch, and I think it sparks some life into this offense. I know this is a three-possession game, but we've seen bigger comebacks than this. Yeah, remember when Miami came back from 23 down in the third quarter to beat the Gators? Yeah, was that... 2003 or was back to pass surveys the field he throws right it falls incomplete number 15 was the intended receiver on that pass that'll bring up second down from the 20 yard line second down drop 
back to pass. He looks. Looks to the end zone. Incomplete. And he misses his wide receiver there. Yeah, you're right. This is an area that he's worked so hard to improve since day one. The accuracy of his throws. He's improved. As you can see, he's upset here with himself. Number seven has four receivers lined up here. He drops back. Looking. Deep pass to the end zone. It's fourth and a bunch. I throw it deep here, and I'll tell you what. Even if it's intercepted, it could work out like a short punt. Fourth and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. Number 38. The kick is up. And it splits the upright. And now we'll take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Michigan, Michigan to kick, number 11, and number, 11, number 7, back, back to, return. to return, kicks it away. Number 11, fields it at the 3, he's tackled at the 19-yard line. The defense was able to keep him out of the end zone on their last possession, but the offense did pick up 3. We've got a 1st and 10, ball on the 19-yard line. They line up in an eye. They'll throw on first down. He's looking. He's under pressure. Looking long to the right. Catches it. And they finally push him out at the 37-yard line. That'll get some good yardage for the receiver. This kid is one heck of a wideout. He's the guy you got to get the ball to as much as you can because he can do things that make you say, whoa. It's first down and 10 now after picking up some great yardage through the air. From the gun. Throws it to the outside. And it's knocked away. Number 11 was the intended target. So that'll make it second down. As a coach, you got to be concerned with what the defense is throwing at you. I tell my quarterback to take what the defense is giving you. Number 25, alone in the backfield. off up the middle. Sheds a tackler and they make the stop at the 32. So they get five yards there on the halfback draw. Third and five coming up. Ball on the 32 yard line. Number 10 lines up in the shotgun. He's looking. He lets it go. And it's caught, and he's taken down at the 14-yard line. I'll tell you, this receiver showed really good hands on that play. This kid is always calling for the ball, and if he keeps making plays like that, he'll continue to get the ball. The pressure turns up when in the red zone, and that's when you turn to Old Spice red zone, when performance matters the most. They'll throw on first down. Looking, he delivers. And it's incomplete. Number 81 was the intended receiver on that pass. That'll bring up second down. It's second and 10. Ball on the 14-yard line. Number 25 lines up in the deep back. I formation. Juke move. And down he goes at the six-yard line. An eight-yard gain. In this short yardage situation, you got to make sure not to pitch the ball unless you absolutely have to. The Buckeyes come out of the ace formation again with a carry. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Good effort by the linebacker to come up and make the play. It's fourth down. This will be a 26 yard field goal attempt. 23 is lined up for the field goal. He gets it up, and he's got it. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary.
Ohio Number 23 gets set to kick this one away. Number 17 back deep to kicks it off. made at the 19. The offense ready to go again. And their last drive ended with three points. I'd get it to the outside and let my back make a play. Ball on the 19-yard line. The Wolverines come out in a two-time inset. They'll drop him for a loss. That was well defended by this defense. Hey, that linebacker made a nice play. But what about all those big guys up front on the defensive line? They're good too, boy. Well, they created the play this time, Coach. The offensive line is so concerned with their penetrating abilities that these linebackers are able to roam free and make plays like that. He gets another carry. He tackles him for a loss. Wow, that was the cornerback who got into the backfield there. How about that for some run support? Well, when you've got a guy that can cover receivers and come in and make big hits in a running game, then you know you've got a special cornerback. This guy can cover like a corner and hit like a safety. That is something special. High formation here. Back to pass. He looks. He wants the long ball. Number 32. Intercepts it. They'll bring him down at the 48 yard line. And credit the safety with that last interception. He knew exactly where the quarterback was going. Timeout. It's not oh, always about athletic game. ability. You've got to be a smart and know what's going on out there. And that comes from breaking down film of the opposing ten. offense and paying ball attention all week in practice. Yard. This safety was ready for today's game. Michigan lines up in a dime defense here. Might have been some early movement up front. Dead ball. Man, live. These are frustrating penalties, coach. You need to discipline these players. Otherwise, they keep making stupid penalties. So your players probably never committed any penalties, right? Oh, yes, they did. But they paid the consequences. Drops back to pass. Surveys the field. He wants it all. And it's caught. And he's tackled at the 17-yard line. And guys, if yards were years, you'd have a half millennium out there today. Well, 500 yards is something you can only dream about as a kid, but to do it in a college football game? Wow. They're in the red zone, where last time they came away with only a field goal. They hand it off, and they make the stop at the 13. About four yards on that play. You just got to make sure that you're gaining positive yardage on a run, because you're almost there. Number 25, the lone back. Again, he'll get the call. Brought down at the seven. They pick up another first, guys. They've got a decent drive going here. Yep, the offense is doing exactly what they have to do. Move the sticks. First down. They'll line it up at the six-yard line. The Buckeyes line up in an I formation. They keep it on the ground with the tailback. And he's hammered down. The halfback gets the call and picks up five. Second down. Here they go, only two yards from Pater. Number 25 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. They'll get him for a loss. Yeah, great upfield rush here by the defensive end. He comes around and manages to get his hands on the ball carry. That's a terrific play. Well, guys, let's see how the offense handles this one. It's third and goal from the six. From the gun. Back to pass. Looks, dumps it. Incomplete pass. Number seven, the intended receiver on the play. Fourth and goal. This isn't much more than an extra point. Number 23, into attempt to field goal. It's up, and it's right down the middle. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary.
everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Number 17, back deep to return. Nice kick, plenty of distance. Tackle at the 19. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. First, and First ten. down, 10 yards Ball to go. On the 19-yard line. Number 20 is the single setback. Back to pass. Looks. He passes it. It's complete. And he's tackled at the 44-yard line. That was a pretty nice completion. Yeah, but it's still a three-possession game. And that's a lot of ground to make up in the fourth quarter. I give him credit, though. This quarterback refuses to give up. Ohio State lines up with five defensive backs. Drop back to pass. He looks. Going long. And it's caught. And he's all the way in for the touchdown. And that's a second time today these guys have been able to hook up for the score. Boy, he really looks comfortable in that end zone, doesn't he? And they line up for the point after. He gets it up, and he adds the extra point. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary. Coach, you got to wonder what they're thinking here. Kicks off. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Just about ready to call the first play of this drive. They were able to pick up a field goal on their last possession. They line up at the 20. First down. Juke move. They bring him down at the 28. An eight-yard gain. I'd run the ball straight up the middle on this one. Second and two. Ball on their own 28. 28-yard line. Ohio State comes out with an eye formation. They'll keep it on the ground again. Short game is enough for the first. Boy, I like that play call. Go ahead and get the first down here. And that tailback definitely has a nose for that first down marker. First, first and ten. ten. Ball on the 31. 31 yard line. They come out with a big set. Uh, they keep it on the ground with the tailback. And he's tackled at the 39. Number 25 gets eight yards on the play. That'll bring up second down. It's second and two. Ball on the 39. Number 25 lines up in the deep back. Eye formation. And he's taken down at the 40-yard line. That run didn't go far. They'll spot the ball a yard from the line of scrimmage. That'll make it third down. Third down, a yard to go. They're crowding the line. Tackle for a loss. And that won't be enough for the first down. Great job here by the defense in shutting down the run. That's a real boost for this team. Fourth down. The Buckeyes are lining up to punt it away. The fine folks from EA Sports would like to tip their hats to these kids on being named Coke Players of the Game. Number 15 already made him pay with a punt return earlier. Punts the ball away. Number 15 takes it at the 23. The offense with a lot of success through the air on that last drive as they moved it down the field for the touchdown. We knew that this team's success would depend heavily on the success of their running back, and it's safe to say, I think, he didn't get the job done today. 
He put up ugly numbers, and as a result, his team's going to come out on the losing end. Before I knock the running back, I want to give some credit to the defense. Touchdown. These linebackers are good, but I didn't know they were this good. It's not easy to shut down a running back of this caliber. No, it's not. He is the playmaker for this offense. I think we saw today that if you keep him from having a big game, you can come away with a win. Yep, you got that right, but listen up. I feel sorry for whoever has to play this running back next because something tells me he's going to explode for some big yardage out there. He hates losing, and he's going to be on a mission the next time he takes the field. Michigan they might be trying to fool him here. Ball. Number 11, back deep to return. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Guys, what do you think about this situation? Now it's just a matter of getting that clock to run to zero. Yep, I'd make sure that no one but my quarterback and running back touched the ball from this point on. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. The Wolverines take a timeout, and that was their last timeout. Second down, 12. about 12 yards Ball to go. On the Ball on the 18. Run. We should just see the quarterback take a knee right here, winding down the rest of this clock. I'd run the ball straight up the middle on this one. Third down, 13. Ball on their own 17. Ohio State comes out with an eye formation. They'll bring him down at the 20. The offense went the way we thought they would. Try to grind it out on third down. Didn't work. Hey, they're winning. Now it's time to put the trust in your defense to perform well. Fourth and It's ten. fourth down. Here comes the punter looking to boot this one away. So this chapter of the rivalry will come to a close. What do you guys think of this game? Ohio State got the better half of the rivalry this year, so they better enjoy their bragging rights now, because this won't be the last time that these two teams meet up on the gridiron. Folks, it's been a lot of fun, and I hope you can join us again next time. Our final score on this one, the Ohio State Buckeyes, 54, and the Michigan Wolverine, 48. This is Brad Nessler with Kirk Herbstreit and Lee Corso. We thank you for playing, and we'll see you next time. Thank you for attending today's ball game. Please drive home safely.